Hello everyone, this is Terry Clark from TLC Design. I am back with another project. This is my butterfly garden um, journal and it is a hardback as you can see. And this is my perma paper and I did some stenciling along here. And this is um, a snippet that I put on here in the corner and this is a 3D butterfly. It's all nice and shiny and hard. And then I put some pink spiked roses on the back, on the spine. And this is the back. Did some stenciling on here as well. There's some cheesecloth on top and bottom. And the closure is this vintage lace. And let's go in and take a look. Still pretty stiff, but it lays flat. So I have a, um, a homemade um, envelope that Paula Lemon had gifted me. And in here, I put some extra um, paper from, or I mean for um, journaling. And then I 3D'd this flower as well. And you just tuck it like that. I got this beautiful lace with the pearls from um, eBay. And right here I got some Franken paper. And I have a used a Tiffany stamp and did a snippet of embellishments. And here are some tags that I had put in here. By the way, I didn't use any specific um, kit in this. This is all just random papers that I had in my stash. So, that one. This one I hold punched and you just open. And then there's this one. Here's another one and I um, snip it. And I did, this is a 3D one too, along with this heart. It's just a little music card. I just think it's so cute. Along with my heart. This is a postcard. It's from the Purple Paper Pad. And some vintage lace with a little flower there. This is some Franken fabric that I was gifted from Debbie from I Plan to Create. Thank you, Debbie. And this is a card. And I put this beautiful vintage fabric on the back, which is what I'm using here. And it does lay flat. All the papers are coffee dyed. This is a book page. And then I have this little tag here. And then a little postcard. And this pretty lady right here. This is from the Dragonfly kit of Artie Mays. There's nothing inside. It's just for you to put something in. Um, here. This is Tsunami Rose. This is Dreams Etc. And I did a look a little... Um, snippet bow thing 
to go ribbon. There we go. To go across. Got two little tags here. Did some uh, Martha Stewart punching on some of the pages. This is a dictionary page. Here's a pocket with some of that lace on it. With some, this is from Artie, um, Tsunami Rose. And this is a prayer um, journaling card from Artie, um, Tsunami Rose. Let's go in there. This is just some uh, um, reading that I have from a magazine. It's kind of like um, poems. Here's another envelope. And it just has an extra journaling card and paper as well. Here, did another little snippet, and this is from Dreams Etc. This is from Paula Lemon that gifted me, and this is from Artie Mays. And I put a little butterfly there up at the top. Here's the other half of that dictionary. This is a um, card that I um, embellished. Here is a tag from my paper pad. This is another tag from my paper pad. And it opens for some journaling. And here's a, some vintage lace with a little button. Here's another snippet that I did. And this is uh, um, from the Perma Paper Pad with some beautiful Hobby Lobby lace. And I got another pretty one of those music cards. And this is just a plain journal card that I um, distressed. Let me tuck it up there. Here. Um, this bag is empty. Put anything for you to use. Here's another um, Dreams Etc. card. This is Tsunami Rose um, with some sewing and coffee dyed paper on the back for journaling. And here's some more of this fabric. Gloria Fisco gave me this and I just think it's gorgeous. I'm going to make a whole journal out of it. Here's some fabric, and I just did a little stencil in there. This is from Paper Pack. Need a little pocket there. Still lays flat. Here's the other end of that. Um, Franken fabric and here's another card fabric on the back I did like a just a little decoration on the side here with the flower and here's a card it's some a stamp and then just a cute little Tim Holtz card well, it's a filing card and you can um, put something 
fiddle in it. And here is a pocket. It's a double pocket. One here. No, it's not. Actually, duh. I'm sorry. But this is a pocket. I did have a double pocket that I did in one journal. I don't remember if it is this journal. So I probably just got myself confused. Is this two signatures? Here's the middle. Second signature starts out with the Franken paper as well. And here I got some of the, these are old journaling pages for, from some old kits. Here's a bag, it's empty. This is my, one of my um, envelopes that a coffee dyed and stamped and altered paper clip on here. There's nothing inside. Here's another journaling page. They're all just random things that I had in my stash. Um, here's a fabric pocket. And I did, um, this is a napkin that I mod podged and I put some gold around it. And this, this is a blank, nope, it's actually got a card in here. Two cards. Here's some, this is from Artie Mays, and this is Artie Mays. The envelope's from the Sweet Rose kit, and this is from the Memories kit. And then a Tiffany stamp index card. That's that. Here's some tags from my stash. Put the journal on. I made this little one, God is Love. This is from my flower book. I just think it's so pretty flowers. Martha Stewart punch. Another empty bag that you can use. Martha Stewart punch. This is a card and yeah. I did Mod Podge this um, doily. A Tim Holtz stencil. This is a Queen Bee stencil that I did. This is from the 1950s. These are some celebrities and it tells you their birth dates. It's really interesting to read actually. I thought this was really gorgeous. It came out of one of my magazines. I just put this other spiky rose on there just for embellish for decoration. This is from the Dragon um, uh, Artie Maze's um, Dragonfly. This was one of my tags. But you can do some. It came from a Kane Company um, pack that I had. Here's the other end of that envelope of Mod Podge Doily. Here's another um, envelope that Paula gifted me, and I did a little snippet on it. Here's a card that I stamped. That's the end of my page from the flower book. This is all journaling.
Facebook page. Here's another envelope. The end of that. Um, this is from one of my paper pads. A card, you just take it off and lots of journaling you can do on it. And another Paula envelope with the 3D flower and the lace. So, this is my butterfly hardback journal. I love her. She will be in my shop. TLC Designs. Oh, TLC Creations Designs on Etsy. Um, hit the like button, share, comment. And the next time, until next time, happy Mother's Day and have a good one.